Welcome to today's webcast about efficient OTT strategies. My name is Andreas. I'm one of the founders of Lightcast.com and Cross Media Group. And I have the privilege today to talk about effective and cost efficient OTT strategies. At Lightcast.com, we believe that your audience is your currency. You just need to know how and where to exchange. Efficient OTT strategies simply means to save time and save money while launching your OTT expansion. There are five major ingredients for effective OTT strategies. Number one, we need to master how to build OTT apps and channels, how to upload and manage content, how to deliver the content to OTT viewers, how to monetize new viewership, and then last but not least, how to market your new OTT broadcast outlets in order to keep your viewership growing. The solutions are simple. To build apps, we need an app developer. To upload and manage content, you need an OVP with an intuitive media management system. And to deliver content to viewers, we need a CDN in place. And to monetize viewership, we need all the necessary monetization tools in place. And to continuously market and grow viewerships, we should deploy an ad network to run ad campaigns across other established OTT properties, capturing their traffic and directing them to your apps. Let's talk about building new OTT channels and apps. It's important to distinguish between mobile apps and OTT or TV apps. They're entirely different. They rest on different technologies, templates, frameworks, and code base. So it is critical to understand that you need to have mobile apps built for mobile app platforms such as iOS and Android mobile apps and TV apps built specifically for each TV app store such as Roku, Amazon Fire TV, Apple TV, Android TV, Samsung Smart TV or other OTT platforms. It is important to start with a user friendly navigation structure. Now you may have all kinds of creative ideas on how your apps should look and function, but start simple. We highly recommend to start right-sized without limiting yourself, meaning make sure that key features can be added easily, but make sure to launch lightweight, fast, and cost efficient. It's important to be able to add future monetization tools, for instance, or lead gen tools, and to be able to extend your navigation structure continuously. Lightcast tip of the day would be select a seasoned OTT app developer, someone who has proven their model and has done it before many times and stay within the developer's framework, but maximize the customization, meaning use the developer's templates, but maximize branding, graphics, customization and navigation structure. Next, we need a management system a system that allows us to upload and manage all content, on-demand video, audio, live streams, live events, linear streams. So ask yourself and your team, which types of media do you intend to publish? Video on demand, audio on demand, live events, linear streams. To which platforms do you intend to publish? What's the navigation structure like? How many channels or categories and navigation tiers do you intend to launch on your TV apps? Are your TV apps all just one flat page of categories or do you have plenty of on-demand content and you can segment it with channels and sub-channels, series? Just discuss your navigation structure internally and come up with a plan and send that over to your OVP and developer. And then metadata management. It is critical to have all the metadata in place for all your media assets such as images, descriptions, keywords, names of, of the videos, titles, uh, caption files, language versions, etc. And then do you serve multilingual content and closed captions? How about cover artwork, custom thumbnails, watermarks? All of this needs to be a feature in place for you, ready to use through your OVP, your online video platform and media management system. Does your OVP provide you with pre, mid, post roll video serving capabilities so that in the future you could run your own promotionals and commercials in your own videos or for your direct advertisers and sponsors? And viewership analytics, how detailed is it? Can you see exactly who is watching from where, how long, on which device, which platform, which country, state and city they're from? All of this should be part 
in your OVP's media management system. There may be other OVP functionalities you need, such as cloud recording of live events or the population of 24-7 streams through drag and drop schedulers. Now, everything we list here, everything you see and beyond is covered by the Lightcast Media Cloud. So the Lightcast tip of the day would be use a multi-platform OVP with future-proof functionalities. Now that we uploaded, transcoded and managed all our video archives, audio archives, linear streams, live events, and added all the metadata, images, and publishing settings to all your apps and connected websites, mobile apps, and TV apps, we now need to deliver that content to the viewers, your OTT viewers on their devices, at their location, wherever they are in the world. And for that purpose, we need to use a robust CDN. And we need to ask ourselves as media publishers, where is our viewership coming from? Is it a local, regional, national, or global viewership we're trying to attract? How large is our current online viewership? If you already publish video on your website, look at the statistics and try to gauge what your expected OTT viewership might look like once you launch your TV apps. Try to anticipate virality, spikes, and scalability for upcoming live events. If you intend to stream live events, just make sure you have plenty of bandwidth power, server power, and failover solutions in your CDN ready to go. Make sure to deliver everything bitrate adaptively, especially for on-demand video. Are you uploading 720, 1080p, 4K, 7K content? What is your resolution you're uploading? Same with live streams. What qualities, what bit rates, what resolutions are you intending to stream? Make sure your CDN is able to accommodate all your needs, all resolutions, all bit rates and qualities and deliver it bit rate adaptively. The Lightcast tip of the day would be use a global bit rate adaptive CDN with at least 50 POPs or data centers worldwide. The Lightcast CDN leveraging the largest CDNs on the planet in a multi CDN setup for our clients uses over 110 data centers with over 250,000 streaming servers collectively for our clients simultaneously. Now that we have all your apps built and launched, all your content uploaded and managed, transcoded and distributed and delivered through a multi CDN setup to every viewer in every corner of the planet on every device and screen possible. You're now growing your viewership at a rate like never before. It is critical now to have monetization tools in place in order to leverage that new viewership. Number one, of course, for product sales. If your company sells services or products, this is the main thing. If you're a nonprofit, it's all about fundraising and increasing donation revenues and attracting sponsors such as direct advertisers, maybe large or small brands or businesses that would like to advertise on your OTT properties or use third party ad networks, video ad networks that can provide you with advertising integration out of the gate. Or if you have plenty of content and you're confident that viewers would pull out a credit card and are willing to pay for it on a monthly basis to offer a subscription or transactions for pay-per-view live events, for instance, or pay-per-downloads. The Lightcast tip would be discuss your revenue strategy and business plan with your business consultant or simply leverage the free business consulting service by Lightcast.com. Now that we have all the necessary monetization tools in place, and we're growing a viewership consistently, now it's important to make sure that viewership continues to grow. In the beginning, as you launch new OTT properties, you will see a spike and a surge in growth initially. But in order not to stop that momentum, but keep it going, it is critical to now market your OTT properties continuously. So first of all, shout it from the rooftops. Use all your existing marketing channels and your existing following on social media, in real life, your customers, everyone can be a promoter of your OTT properties. Promote good ratings in the app stores. Ask everyone you know, your customers, your social followers to go to the app stores, find your apps, download them, install them, watch them and give it a five star rating and maybe write a positive review in the app store. Run OTT ad campaigns on other established OTT channels. There are many OTT channels and apps out there that accept advertising. You might do the same as well. This provides a great opportunity for you as a publisher to grab the attention of the traffic and viewership on other OTT channels and apps. Just think about it. The viewers are already on the platform. 
If you're trying to grow your Roku viewership, then just run an ad campaign on other Roku channels. Viewers are already there. They're just one click on their remote control away from downloading, installing, and watching your TV app on Roku as well. And this goes for every platform. Like as tip, download the white paper on 10 tricks on how to boost your OTT viewership. And then of course, contact us to redeem a $10,000 credit towards an OTT ad campaign today. So again, here are the five critical ingredients to master. Number one, how to build OTT channels and apps. We know we need app developers. How to upload and manage content. We need an OVP with an intuitive media management system. To deliver content to our viewers, we need CDNs. To monetize our viewership, again, we need an OVP that provides all those monetization tools. And then to market new broadcast outlets, we should leverage video ad networks to run ad campaigns on other established OTT properties. Now, these are different vendors that you might need, but you can also just simply work with one vendor that can provide everything in an end-to-end -end package solution. We look forward to hearing from you. And here at Lightcast, we got you covered from A to Z. As your OTT, mobile, and web app developer, your OVP with Intuitive Media Management System, the Lightcast Media Cloud, our multi-CDN integration, and our fully integrated ad network to continuously promote and market your OTT properties.